celebration of restriction covenants for those who checked their email last night. Uh, <laughs> yes, this, this has been a work in progress. So the declaration is associated with the chapter 163 develops agreement uh, that you just recently approved the final reading on. So again, we're trying to make sure all of our documents are aligned and consistent. And, uh, and this uh, covenants uh, also is consistent with the 2032 comprehensive plan that you approved back in January. Uh, the declaration is consistent with the board's planning powers uh, in those documents. And there's two primary things here. It is to guide and accomplish the coordinated balanced and harmonious development of the land within the district in accordance with the existing and future needs. And it memorializes that the district property will be used for valid government purposes to promote the general welfare of the district's inhabitants and property owners. Um, so our recommended motion would be to move for the board to approve the district ministry to sign the declaration of restricted covenants by the district in substantial form as attached and is distributed um, in the case there's any changes letting me make any minor changes that may have come up in the days ahead that we discuss. Uh, I'll ask you any questions you have. Questions? Comments? All right, I'd entertain a motion to uh, approve this declaration of restrictive covenants and authorize the district administrator to execute it on behalf of the district. Motion in a second. All in favor, please indicate by saying aye. Aye. 